In today's video, Dakota of Earth, wait a sec, it's kind of a weird name, isn't it? Where else would he be? From fucking Mars? Anyway, Dakota of Earth is going to ingest 30 grams of ground DMT containing root bark to finally put to the test of whether or not you can or cannot trip from Acacia Confusa alone without the presence of a monoamine oxidase inhibitor. Now, just to be clear, Acacia Confusa is a 100% legal tree, plant, whatever you want to call it. It grows in Hawaii, it grows in Taiwan, it grows in other parts of the world, and it contains within its root bark dimethyltryptamine, and in dimethyltryptamine at that, which is an illegal substance, but because there are hundreds of DMT-containing plants, they couldn't make them all illegal if they wanted to. Not that I'm suggesting anyone go and try this. Oh. I need to make it clear that we do not advise that anyone follow in Dakota's footsteps. We're basically doing this in the name of science. And to put finally to the rest this mystery or this myth that people online keep perpetuating, because, you know, people online are super scientific, super smart people online who can always be trusted. They like to say all kinds of random ass weird shit, such as you can take DMT bark, mix it with the banana, blend up into a nice smoothie, and drink it without a MAOI, and still have a full-on ayahuasca-like experience. For those of you who don't know, ayahuasca is basically uh, what that is. Ayahuasca is drinking DMT with a harmaline, harmala alkaloid, such as uh, Shakruna, which contains the DMT, mixed with uh, Banisteropsis capi. I cannot pronounce this shit at all because I'm, you know, really good scientist over here. And yeah, that's what's called ayahuasca and that's what people go to the jungle to drink to fix all their problems and to have it from some not so shady shaman that they met online through fake or maybe not fake Google reviews. And you got to be freaking careful, guys. Anyway, just to be clear, we do not advise that anyone follow in Dakota's footsteps. We... According to YouTube's guidelines shown here, videos which intend to educate are documentary by nature and do not glorify the use of drugs. Both abide by the community safety guidelines and are eligible for monetization. The following video does not glorify the use of drugs. Instead, it attempts to be non-biased while delivering vital life-saving information disguised as entertainment. Please be aware that unsafe psychedelic use can lead to bouts of psychosis, PTSD, or even death. Do not try this at home. The experiment is being monitored by healthcare professionals in case anything goes wrong. Thank you. Now, in case you can't tell, this video is being done in a very different style than usual. Usually, we have these uber-scientific, well-thought-out planned videos, but this time we decided to switch things up and we're going to take you along for the ride with us, kind of like vlog style, so you feel like you're right there holding Dakota's long luscious locks back as he vomits over the toilet. So, hope you guys enjoy chilling with us weirdos for a little while, and let's get on with the video. Cheers. This guy said it hit him in, in an overwhelmingly strong and short time, around 30 minutes, he said it hit him. In 30 minutes? Yeah. And how much did he take? Uh, five tablespoons of ground acacia root bark, brewed ayahuasca style, without any additives. That's from what website? Shroomery? DMT Nexus. Cool. Why aren't they actually saying, though, exactly how many grams they're taking? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why everyone's breaking it down in tablespoons. Tablespoons. Far. That's not... Yeah, it's I, weird. It's I a weird something a little more scientific than that. More recreatable. Tablespoons aren't accurate. Regardless, we're just going to assume that it was, what, four? Four grams, I think, is good. Four grams per tablespoon? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's what I would assume. Okay. I'll, okay. Tr I'll trust you. You have a YouTube channel. Oh, don't trust me. <laughs> In fact, I have nothing you to do with YouTube this. You make YouTube videos, I trust you. I, you're, this is all on you, man. You're weighing this. I, I want no part in this. What if something happens? I can't be held liable. Here you go. <laughs> all right, so what do we do? How many? Four <laughs> times five? Eight, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21? 21 grams? Are you crazy? Was, was that way off? Four times five is 25. <laughs> what did I say? 21. Yeah. All right, 25. So what's the di difference between acacia and mimosa? They're different plants. But you're doing 30, right? 30? Okay, I'll do 30. Well, look at Dakota being the scientist trying to get this exact here. Oh, 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 oh there it is. There we go. Boom. I mean, 30. 3,000 grams. 3,000 grams. All right. <sighs> Give it a sniff. It doesn't really smell like anything. It just kind of smells like a plant. Huh. It smells like a ground up plant or like a ground up bark. 
Seems accurate. Are you nervous? I'm a little nervous. I don't know what to expect. Because if I start seeing jaguars and ayahuasca visions in your basement... <laughs> I don't know, man. This is your gonna... dog turns into a giant jaguar. I'll be all right, I think. Maybe. Yeah, this isn't I ayahuasca, can, If I'm though. supposed to die, this is how I'm supposed to die. <laughs> <laughs> all right, man. It's great. Great. I, I accept it. Die in your house. Could be an all right way to go. It's a good mindset, though. Because you, you know, when, you're ego, my mom. when you're ego-deathing, you don't know that it's different. So you definitely want to go into a potential ego death with those thoughts. Yeah. Yeah. Being accepting of it. I once told myself I wouldn't trip again unless I was able to accept I could die before starting. Like, don't trip with the idea oh, in your God. head that you're afraid of dying. So it's that whole thought train that leads you into I'm panic station. terrified to die. Oh, shit. <laughs> no. <laughs> but I accept it. Like, I'm going to die one day, right? So let's, let's do it. Let's kill me on YouTube. I'm not doing that. You can upload it. <laughs> Man, you're starting this down. What do you think of this hat? Uh, God, it's going to be the last thing I see before I pass away. Can you away. stop? Look, look, it says infinity on it too. How weird is that? It kind of says infinity. Infinite. Like Infinite. Imagine like you're tripping and you see the infinity thing on this and it's just like, oh, it sends you down yeah. fractal hats. I like just zoom into it. Yeah, like like the kaleidoscope of hats and then oh, my face shit. smiling. God damn it, what did I get myself into? <laughs> All in the name of science. Hold on, let's get that infinite. Okay, hey, let's see it on you. I gotta grab one thing. <sighs> God damn it, guys. He kidnapped me. He's forcing me to do this. Uh oh. <laughs> Now, now that I've got the lab this code is the, on, this is the official. Now it's officially a science experiment. Here we go! Okay, should we read some, some, see what people say? Yeah, I mean, see what people say, because like, I really, really doubt anything's gonna happen. But you seem to be starting to believe that something will happen. I don't know, it, it, it seems 50-50. My understanding of how it works is you, if you have to have M MAOI for it to work. But it ayahuasca works is traditionally MAOI. used with uh, chakruna leaves. Yeah, so this is this is a southeast Asian plant. Yeah. So this isn't this isn't a plant that's traditionally found where you would find ayahuasca. No. If it's, you look at just the profile of Acacia confusa, it has NMT in it, which is proposed to have very little effects, if any, when taken on its own, but I found that it synergizes with DMT. Hmm. I find it more pushy and more likely to cause entity contact. Okay, cool. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so this guy says, has anyone brewed up Acacia Confusa bark on its loathsome and witnessed DMT-like effects? Someone said, I haven't tried it myself, but I did talk with somebody in, the, in this chat room and they said it was active alone and he did it twice just to make sure. What dose? 30 grams, both times. Wow. Yeah. Mm. This guy says, it is active, but an MAOI is needed for the real DMT effects. So maybe it's active, but it's not the DMT that's causing the effects. Maybe so it's, it's another alkaloid in there that's making a trip. Huh. Oh man, that's real weird. Huh. That's different. Could it be the, the N NMT? Could be. Wait, hold on, hold on just a, a naked minute here. What if NMT is active without an MAOI? Should we Google it? Yeah. Wikipedia says, blah, blah, blah. It is a common component in human urine. Hmm. Wow. Okay. Orally administered NMT appears to produce no psychoactive effects. However, it may become active with combination of a monoamine oxidase inhibitor. Shit. So it's not the NMT. So if you're hmm. tripping and there's no MAOI in this, then it's likely not from the NMT. It might not be from the DMT. DMT. There could be some unknown mystery alkaloid just swimming around in this brew that we're about to concoct. Um, or it just doesn't work. Or it just doesn't work. Yeah, or these people yeah. are just liars. Yeah. You internet. Yeah, you goddamn liars. Getting me addicted to my piss with your <laughs> miscommunications. Uh, 3,000 grams. 3,000 grams. Oh my gosh, it's Scientist Dakota. He's ready to conduct some super serious experiments in the name of science. Okay, so what do I do first? Do I turn this on first? <laughs> I did 10 years in university for this. What's cool? Um, <laughs> uh, Cambridge. Cool. Is school? It was a school. Cool, who's your favorite teacher? Mr. Schmolt.
Yeah. So we'll let it go for a little bit and see see what happens, see where it takes us, hopefully into a different dimension. Is there anything you want to like, I don't know, you're looking to gain from this dimension? Um, yeah, I'm looking to gain some sort of uh, energetic supernatural abilities. Like cultivate the energy from a different dimension into this dimension. Create, I don't know, weapons of mass destruction and you know, that kind of thing. Yeah, it's pretty common. You always see people talking about that online. I, I took some byproduct of DMT. Yeah. This in there. Okay, you gotta add a little bit of yourself in there too, right? Yeah, of course. You're gonna or into your you can take uh, other people's hair. Yeah, um, then you can jump into their bodies. Potentially, it's more of a stealing their life force, their life energy. Their Fuck, life. man! Here, take some of my arm hair. Well, I would take some of your hair, but yeah, I guess the arm hair is what I have to do. Yeah, you gotta pull hard. Oh man, I'm up in this park now. Yeah, definitely a trip now with all, the, with all the shit you have in your system. Dude, my DNA is made of, my, my blood is pure LSD. And you said everyone said to put a banana in it? Yeah. Smells great. It smells better than it did, I guess. So what do I do? I start drinking it? <laughs> what are you asking me for? <laughs> Guys, I hate all these warning screens as much as you do, but just to be totally crystal clear again, just because Acacia Confusa can be legally obtained, it does not mean that we recommend anyone consume it. As I showed you guys earlier, there is an actual YouTube Red series where Michael from Vsauce consumes ayahuasca, and we're talking real ayahuasca in the jungle, has a full trip, and that's a YouTube Red series. Sometimes people from YouTube review these videos and they don't realize that there's actually a video already out there that exists, and which may not actually be, uh trying to do anything super uber scientific here. Anyway, let me just let you get back to the video now that I've made our intentions as clear as this camera's resolution. God, it's so bitter. It's gonna be hard, hard to drink. God. I'm gonna need to chase it with water. Pour yourself a cup of water, man. Go right ahead. No. Yeah, I might, but off camera. Gotta look cool for the ladies. You guys come here often? Mm. To the Psych Substance YouTube channel? Head over mine, ladies and boys. Oh, it's making me hot. Or maybe it's just hot in here. Ugh. Remember, this is all for science. Don't forget what you're doing this for. Like, this is gonna make some fucking waves, man. Make those waves. Then get the surfboard out and ride them. Ride them all the way into the alternate dimension where the waves, the waves ride you. And then you are everything. You are the wave. I don't know what you're talking about. It might come up, I'm not gonna lie. I don't feel like I'm gonna puke, but I feel like, I feel like I could puke. Woo! I guess people are coming right now already. Oh no. Why don't you try taking a step outside? God damn it. <laughs> oh god. Ginger. No, no, that's good, I'm good. Is that it? Does that count? No, nope, gotta get it all. That'll be easy to drink though now, that's just like nothing. It came right back up. You still gonna clean your dishes with this? No. No, I'd say that's gonna find its home in the garbage. All right, man, how you feeling? Uh, I feel on top of the world right now. I didn't puke, thankfully. <laughs> uh, 
Um, I feel all right right now. I think I don't feel nauseous. How? So you're not sweating as much? No, I feel relatively all right right now. Oh fuck! Oh god damn it! God damn my whole entire life. Why are you doing this for? This is what happens in Canada. This is what Canada's about. Canada, yeah. That's what Canada does to people. Brave guy over here. There's no way in hell I'd do that. Not a chance. So now what, we just wait and see what happens? You tell me, you're the scientist. Yeah, I guess we just wait and see what happens. Yeah, we'll, we'll give it... I don't know, I guess maybe... an hour to kick in? Didn't some of the reports say it took up to two? Yeah, some, I think even said three. Three, yeah. Maybe God's making you puke because he's like, you're not invited. I don't want you to come meet me. People do uh, take things like ayahuasca and have some quite mystical experiences. Granted, what you had isn't traditionally ayahuasca. There is DMT involved, which is considered the light. All right, man, it's been one hour. How are you feeling? Uh, I'm feeling pretty s normal still. There was a period just like five minutes ago where I thought colors were getting a little weird. When I trip, I usually look at the lines in my hand just to see that's kind of like my, how I can tell if it's kicking in, if the lines in my hand start dancing around. That looks good so far, I think. Normal good, I guess. Yeah, I think I feel normal. Three hours later. Whoa, three and a half hours since you <laughs> took it. You got anything going on, man? Nothing going on. Yeah, nothing happened. Which is what we kind of expected. We didn't really expect anything to happen. I was kind of hoping it would a little bit. Oh, well. So, does this mean you're gonna... Are you down to try, like, real ayahuasca at some point? Oh, I'm gonna try real ayahuasca, yeah, eventually. Yeah. Probably not in your basement, but... No, I hope not. No. But... Yeah. It's better in the jungle, more traditional. Oh, man, I wish it worked. Because then it would have made... Throwing all over, throwing up all over your sink. <laughs> it would have given it a reason to have happened. Yeah, man, as they say, the juice was not worth the squeeze this time. The juice was not worth you, the squeeze this time. You didn't even get any juice, you just like I just got the, the squeeze. Juice. Didn't seem to work for me. Yeah, unfortunately, this doesn't do much for science because yeah. you're just one person. Yeah. We need to get like a bunch of you guys. Well, what's your address? We can, we can, should we tweet it? Have some people come up? Maybe you need like uh, special genetics. Yeah, maybe you need to be a mutant. There's so many variables here, but for the sake of a psyched substance, super scientific um, test, we keep things just so tightly within the bounds of science that you cannot dismiss the factual evidence that we have d uncovered here. This was a complete success. It was a success, guys. Complete we did it. success. We found out that you cannot trip on Acacia Confusa without Harmalas. We need the Harmalas. Hope you guys enjoyed. Oh, huge thank you for Dakota. Everybody, give him a nice yay. Thanks, Dakota, for being on Psych Substance. Woo! All my dreams. Woo, you and Tom now have both come out <laughs> and puked. Yes. Yeah, you guys, yes. you and Tom are boys. Yes. Shout out to Tom. I need to throw up. Tom was talking to me uh, last night on Skype, and he, he wants to Skype come out like... and like uh, do like a three-way. Ooh. Nothing sexual though. Oh. Okay. <laughs> like uh, a three-way collab where we do okay, like yeah, a three-way live experience. Yeah, we should do that. And then in the next video, all three of us will be puking. <laughs> on and each other. On, on each other. And then maybe the juice will be worth the... We'll use it as <laughs> lubricant for the... <laughs> oh boy. Let me know if you want to see that. I think, I think it would be great. Not, not that other thing would be great. Not, not the lube thing. Bye.